Good day, fellas. Lightang 8 for T55A. Capture the base or decap the base. Win game, destroy two enemy vehicles. You think this mission is hard? It is. It is annoying. But I found the secret recipe how to deal with all this. I did the same thing with the medium tanks. I did the same thing with the um, light tanks. And it works like a charm. Speak with your teammates. Whenever the battle is looking like one, just politely ask to win uh, the game by capping the base. You will see that yourself. It is going to be pretty um, funny experience. And this is going to be a good one. Um, pretty much how the things are happening, at least for me, whenever I see the team is winning, I am going into the gap, uh, into the cap and I am simply starting to cry. Yeah, fellas, I am stuck for seven months for this mission. I cannot complete it. Please help me. And it works like a charm. If you never ever try to do that, I would highly recommend to do this. Also, another tip, have encounter uh, battles available. Uh, so whenever someone is going to cap the base, you can decap them. Right? So all type of battles available. This is very, very important thing. And now, without further ado, let's teleport straight into the game and let's see how this beauty is looking like. And we are back, fellas. So this is how we are completing the mission. Simple as this. We got Ansk map, which, let's get real, is not the finest map to cap the base or even dreaming about capping the base. By the way, this mission took me, like, a couple of tries, if not from the very first try. I was extremely happy about this and I was flabbergasted. Anyways, looking into all of this, we have some guys who are sniping from the back and I decided to play with a tier 7 was uh, I thought, why the heck not? I want to give quite a bit of the variety for you watching the, um, watching the mission completion and to be completely honest with you, you can complete this mission with any light tank tier 6, tier 7, tier 8. I would highly recommend to stick around the lower tiers for obvious reasons. Meanwhile, what we noticed, we noticed our team is trying to do something on the field, right? And I thought, um, I had an idea for a moment. Maybe I could actually go on the field, try to help our team clear the field, and we can beat the living crap out of everyone by capping the base here. But at the point, I saw the light and crossing like this, so I a bit changed my mind. That is completely fine. We have all time in the world of tanks. We are just chilling and we are just enjoying ourselves. Beautiful shot to the Super Hellcat. Very, very nice. Obviously, my mission is to cap the base. So I am thinking how in the smart way we can deal with everything without, uh, um, without losing it, right? Because my main focus is the mission. I am not focusing on as much damage. I am not focusing as, uh, as much assisting damage or something like this. My main thinking process here is to cap the base. And looking into all of this, fellas, one two line is taking a bit for the team, right? There is T3485M who is going in front, and we can always say hello for him. We are peeking sideways a bit, unfortunately, we are bouncing the shot from the Russian tier 6 medium tank, which is quite funny, but that is all right. We can spank him for a second time, and this is exactly what we are doing. We are taking our time, and we are um, chilling a bit. I do not want to lose any hit points whatsoever. It is a bit too early, and we found the tourist IS. We know IS is sitting in the back. We know this gentleman is stuck. Fine, fair enough. Now I'm paying attention into the map once again and it looks a bit better, right? At this point, our team is winning the game um, quite significantly, I would say. So the idea is simple. Clear the field, go into the cap and start crying. This is what is happening in my head and this is the initial, uh, um, initial thoughts for me how to deal with all of this and how we can be successful and how we can deal with this mission. Believe me, whenever I was live streaming those missions, right, a lot of people we are complaining about this one capping the base because uh, currently in the current world of tanks, games are very, very short. Uh, they are four minutes, five minutes. Well, if you are lucky, you can have a 15 minutes game, but it will happen only once in a very, very long time. So, you know, you cannot expect to have capping um, options that often. So, you know, that's why. And I can respect that. I can understand that. This is not so simple to do. 
Meanwhile, we have two heavy tanks sitting still in the back and I am considering my life choices how I would be able to eliminate this Vaka 3002M from the game. And I figured it out, what about if we are going to destroy his building? If we will destroy his building, it's going to be a, a good thing, don't you think so? And now it is a showtime, boys and girls, ladies and gentlemen. Enemies have five, actually four tanks alive at this point, and I am going straight into the base. I have only one kill, by the way. I need to get one more kill, so I am going for a kill. I am thinking, no. Spitz, are you still sitting here? Please tell me you do. Excellent. Two kills. Now we are going into the base. And look at this. Uh, look at the chat. Fellas, can we cap? I have a mission. <sighs> I am stuck forever and ever for this mission. Please help me cap, guys. Please help me cap. <laughs> Please. I'm stuck on this mission forever and ever. <sighs> Please help me, Cap. <laughs> and you would be surprised how, how often this uh, works. You see, uh, it is so hard in the world of tanks. Please help me. Thank you. That's it. That's all you needed to do. Uh, have a conversation with your teammates obviously playing in platoon uh it is it is very beneficial as well situation right by saying it is very beneficial i mean if you are playing in platoon it is just simply way easier to cap the base in the long term and look at this you on your cap mission cap if you want thanks you are awesome hip hip hooray here we go capture mission done gg finito you see, have a conversation with the guys in the game. It is not that hard thing to do. And um, people are feeling the same frustration whenever they are playing for a missions like this. Um, obviously, once again, extremely important thing to highlight. You can't play in platoon with your friends, right? Or with the clanmates or however you would call. A um, bunch, uh, bunch of guys drinking beer in the evening and having some fun in the world of tanks, right? You can try to do that with, uh, with uh, friends as well. Uh, so, yeah, this is very, very important thing to highlight. Anyway, scoreboard, let's go. And here we go, fellas, the score. Uh, game in total lasted for 5 minutes 30 seconds. We are top by experience. We are top by, actually, we are second or third by the damage. This is completely fine. And the most important thing is LT8 completed with a humongous help of this gentleman. Thank you very much. Urin Panzer, you helped us greatly. So this is how you are completing the cap mission. It took me three uh, tries to cry a bit in the chat whenever there is a correct moment to go and cap the base and that worked um pretty well well i supposed to say cap the base right so don't be too afraid of this mission i believe you are going to do this whenever you have a chance to cap whenever your team is winning go into the cap and start crying in the chat maybe uh, people will help you and i believe they will thank you very much for watching and this is how to deal with light tank 8 mission